Hello everyone, in this video I'll be showing you how to clean up your iTunes library on Windows and Mac. So for our Windows section, we're going to be using Wondershare Tunes Go, which you can download offline. And then what we're going to do is plug in our device, and we're going to click on this switch up here, and this will launch the iTunes plugin. Alright, and this is what it looks like, it's just a little sidebar attached to our iTunes. Okay, and then it's going to load up our music on the side here. And what we can do to manage these and clean it up a bit is to delete anything that we don't listen to or we don't need. So if you want to delete a playlist of music, you can just select it. You can also go in and see all the songs that are in it. And then to manage it, we can, e we can export it to iTunes or our PC. In this case, I'll export to my PC so I can back it up and then delete it. So I'll select where I want to save it and click on OK. And now all we have to do is go over to our iTunes and select that playlist we didn't like and we'll click on delete and we'll say delete. And now we've just saved that room on our device. And you can do this of course for your movies, podcasts, anything that's on your device. And since I've actually backed those up on my computer, what I can do is just delete them out of iTunes if I wanted to. And that would save me a lot of space. And on the Mac, we're going to be using a program called Music Brains Pickard, which you can download for free. To use this app, we just need to click on Add Folder and select something like our iTunes folder, and then click on Choose. And it will scan all of those and drop them into here. If I select a file, it will tell me lots of information about it, like how long it is, the artist, etc. And up at the top of the menu, we can play that file, we can save it, and we can also adjust the information as well as remove it if we need to. It allows us to sort by the title. So if there are any files that are very similar, in this case we have a duplicate, what we can do is remove it. You can utilize this program to clean up your music library. And that's it for this video. That's how you clean up your iTunes music library.